Yes, yeah, well, he's got four and a half kilos more this time than he hit last year. So he's gone up in the weights, but he's got a bit of class, and uh, I think uh, Ricky Mangard would certainly like to see him in the first four here. Well, Terence Millard won this race six times uh, in the 1980s. Let's see if his son, Tony Millard, can emulate that with surfing home this afternoon as we cross now for the commentary to Craig Peters. And a close-up view of Star Root and Gavin Fenter. He's doing a last-minute adjustment to his goggles. Ginger Cake in the blue silks alongside. Interesting to note that Spacewalk has won six out of his seven starts at this track, Gravel. So he's really in love with this Durban track. Now it's the turn of Ardeviv, the top weight, being led up to the stalls. Now turns away under Kevin Shea. Draw 16, although the draw, I feel, does not make any difference over this type of trip. And in the far side is Spring Hill with the white cap. Spring Hill also won't have any stamina problems. Runners inside the stalls, this is Gaelic Find and Glen Hat. Gaelic Find now being led up. He's going this trip for the first time. Goes halfway in. Gaelic Find, the runner-up in last year's Rothman's July, when he kicked on stoutly in the closing stages, now in stalls. There's White Tie, Fi white tie Affair, the horse that we were talking about, the grey one of the three lorry Jaffe runners. So take note, he's the grey one under Dougie White, who is now the stable jockey, incidentally, once again to David Payne. Goes forward for the Gold Cup, 500,000 rand. And this is Conman and Jeff Lloyd. Conman won over 3,000 metres here at Gravel about three months ago. They're just about set. Runners sent on their way in South Africa's premier long distance horse racing event. And the early leader, Spring Hill, surfing home immediately going off to lead them. The grey along the rail is Russian nature, Spring Hill is well placed. Ginger Cake on the right hand side with the blue silks trying to get over. Then catch 22 followed by another grey sweet secret. Past the post the first time, Ginger Cake's going to just get there from surfing home. Those two cross the line as one. Spring Hill is right there and Stateway is there with the red nose band, but only two lengths off the lead. Arda Viva has overcome his wide draw, Russian nature, the grey along the rail. Then catch 22, Sweet Secret is behind that, then How High the Moon. We drop back to Comanche Chief, White Tie Affair, 14 lengths off them with Costa Ruler. Conman is on the outside of horses. As they settle down, down the back stretch, and it's Ginger Cake, a head on view with the blue silks, the leader. Spring Hill with the blue blinkers second and surfing home just obscured along the rail, the pink colours just off the lead. Then Stateway on the outside, how high the moon. Costa Rula on the extreme right hand side of your picture with the red sleeves, Conman the yellow cap on the right hand side. White tie affair, the grey and sweet secret, another grey, they in the middle of your picture about 10 lengths off the lead. Space walk along the rail, pink sleeves and pink cap. Then Comanche Chief, Oriental Examiner and Gaelic Find with Man of Substance and Great White Way. They go to the 1600 in the Gold Cup and Spring Hill, the Blue Blinkers, goes off to lead Ginger Cake. Surfing home, perfectly placed at the rail third, the red nose band of State Way is fourth. Then Conman, Art of Even Catch 22 with Russian Nature and Sweet Secret. Spacewalk at this stage, 15 lengths off the leader with White Tie Affair being niggled at. Then Comanche Chief and behind that Coaster Ruler and Oriental Examiner. Then Oral Del Cello, Great White Way is second to last and Man of Substance the trailer. They go to the 1200 in the Gold Cup, Spring Hill, but there goes Surfing Home. Pulled off the rail is only a length off them. Surfing Home's going to go early, then Ginger Cake. Conman, Jeff Lloyd's not asleep. He's let Conman go to be prominent. Along the rail is the grey Russian nature, Art of Eve. On the outside, Gaelic find the yellow sleeves and yellow cap. Then coast to ruler, Oriental Examiner. Space walk still a dozen lengths off them. The grey white tie affair continuing to be niggled at. Surfing home has found the lead in the Gold Cup as they travel to the 700 by two. Spring Hill second. On the outside, Ginger Cake. Stateway is fourth, then out of even Conman. Russian nature, ten lengths off the leader. On the outside, Gaelic find. Spacewalk now a dozen lengths off the leader, then White Tire Fair and Sweet Secret. Behind that, Oro del Cello, How High the Moon, Star Roots and Man of Substance. Into the home stretch in the Gold Cup and surfing home, clear, five lengths. On the outside, Stateway and Ginger Cake. Art of Eve's making a determined challenge. They come down to the 400 and surfing home's the leader. Stateway's the danger on the outside. And Spacewalk's kicking on. On the inside, Art of Eve. White Tire Fair's checked for a run. 
surfing on but Stateway has gone past him and it's Stateway who's hit the front of the 100 to go gonna cause a huge upset Stateway wins it by one length Surfing home second, Spacewalk third, Conman fourth, then Oral Del Cello. White Tie Fair was balked at the 200 meter marker. He was running on well, but he did not get the clearest of passage. End of the way, but Stateway came alongside him with 100 to go. Surfing home tried to fight back doggedly, but Stateway has got his measure by three parts of a length from Surfing home. Along the rail is Spacewalk, Pink Fleas and Pink Cap. Conman is there with Art of Eve. But Stateway continues to run and will win it in the end by about one length from surfing home. Certainly not disgracing defeat. Three lengths back behind that was Spacewalk. Conman ran fourth. Behind that, Art of Eve and Oral Del Cello. White tie affair beaten about six lengths at the end. Well, that was quite an astonishing race, David Mollett. Uh, number 12, Stateway who would have started, I think, at any price. Well, any price uh, indeed, Robin. And uh, in Port Elizabeth, they'll be cheering like mad because this horse uh, trained by Arthur Miller and uh, certainly really uh, did most of his racing in, in Port Elizabeth and uh, very few people thought this good. But this is the Grand National of South African racing and we've got a huge upset. Well, this is uh, the longest distance uh, he won.